Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to some more Catch You With A Fogman playthrough, episode 36 with the series. Um, we ended up, I ended up taking those backpacks out of the way station there, so everybody here up in the front's got uh, backpacks. I figure they'll be handy. If it becomes a problem, I can always handle it later on, but I want to have the backpack space because we're going to be hitting a lot of ruins, and we've already filled up, um, you know, Dozer's got a lot of food, and, and uh, Bully here is looking pretty full, so... It'll only be a matter of time if we end up hitting more places. The Forbidden Zone lies beyond the way to the Ashlands. Ooh. Survivors who've journeyed through here are hard to come by. People don't tend to come back alive. Oh. What's that? Through this area? The uh, bone fields? Well, that, I can see that. They find skinless corpses in the pits. They say, uh, say there's mist ghouls that flay and eat you. <clears throat> well, we are the mist ghouls, right? So... Does that mean there's more fogmen down here? Mist schools don't exist. Well, how do you know? <laughs> I know a guy who knew another guy that knew this woman <laughs> whose second uncle saw one while he was selling cactus rum outside Crabtown. Well, fair enough. Not real. They're real. I saw one once. I, it told me to eat more green fruits, then turn into a purple bone dog and melt it into... What? Wait, wait, yeah, I remember. Just stop talking. That's a cool guy here telling everybody to stop talking. <laughs> He's had enough. Had enough of your missed ghoul stories. So, missed ghoul, fogman, potato, potato, same thing. Ooh, skin spiders. Ah, he... These guys look mean. I don't think I've ever dealt with these before. Well, if these are new to the area down here or what, but I don't think I want to fight them. They're all in the 40s stats. We could handle it, but not if they kept coming. Speak of the devil, what are they fighting right now? A group of bulls. No, what are, they, what are these? Boneyard wolf. It's different. This really isn't that safe of an area. They're fighting a group of... I don't know. What are these guys? The Band of Bones. Okay, they're getting wrecked by them. Oh. I'm, a, I'm a little nervous, I'm not going to lie. This area might be a more dangerous than I thought. Hopefully, I brought enough people. Stuff still being researched back at home base. Wow, look at that. That thing's huge. Is that where that uh, city is? Maybe Morn is inside there? I don't know what faction controls that city. If it's even somebody that likes us. Oh, yeah, there's a whole city inside there. Some type of like giant engine or something at one point. Ooh, a lot of this stuff still loading in. Can't imagine why they call this place the Bone Fields. <laughs> All right, what do we got before I just run in? Well,. We've got cages outside for one, which is different. Um, turrets that don't appear to be manned. And a lot of broken buildings and an ancient lab. Um, there's people inside here. The trade ninjas. Well, I'm going to say they don't like us. Because I'm seeing a lot of red. Trade ninjas, negative 100. But they're not that tough. Well, yeah, they are. Not all of them are. They're so, well, that's a tech hunter. Yeah, they're pretty tough. I wouldn't mind pulling one. I wonder what kind of gear they got. If it's like high grade or standard. Um, nighttime is coming, so I think I'm going to go ahead and break in. I 
See if I can find anything. This is a bar here. Uh, I could pull. That's a tech hunter, though. So I could pull a trade ninja. I want to head up into here. It's locked, actually. So this is this is a abandoned HQ. Okay, I want to know what's in there. These guys have a lot of cages. This place is destroyed. There's like nothing left. Might be able to loot some of the stuff, but I, I don't even know. Holding alt here, I don't. I see the bar. Um, the uh, tech hunter shop. And that's about it. There just isn't a whole lot here. I'm not sure if I'm going to get around these guys. That ah, pulled it off, though. Nope, pick, pick lock. Ha ha. Got around these suckers. All right, let's see what we can find. There ain't nothing in here. There's a book. But that's it. Huh. Shop counter. So this has been, uh... What the heck? Great white gorilla. Oh, wow. Look at this guy's stats. Wow. He's got, he's, he's got stats in the hundreds. Um... Bunch of training dummies. Oh my goodness. This must have been some barracks at some point. They got attacked and that was that. Oh man. There's uh, some stuff up here. Another book. Um, There's some wooden chests. Some weapon cabinets. But I don't know. Oh, definitely. What about up here? Holy crap. Junk pile. More weapon cabinets. Says they're all empty. A smash chest. Another weapon cabinet. Uh, more books. Is there even any reason to go in here? It doesn't seem like there's really anything worth grabbing. Um, I've got an idea though. How fast is this guy? Huh. 23 miles per hour. We're 17 because I'm in sneak. 29 when I'm not in sneak. All right, we're going to pull this guy into the town and see if he'll attack the guards unless he's like part of them, which is very po Oh, It says wildlife, so... He doesn't see me just yet. But he will. Maybe. I'm really thinking that there's nothing up here. She's going to really upset me. Especially with something so, like, just crazy up here guarding it. It just feels wrong. Just in case. I 
He is not moving. Is he stuck? I was going to bring him out of the town. I thought it'd be pretty funny. He is stuck. What's with the pathfinding in this game? Oh, oh. He is. He's stuck. He can't attack me. And I can't attack him. Okay. Oh, oh, I thought he was attacking me. I do have block on. So I should get a bonus. If he does decide to attack, but I don't think he's going to. It looks like he just literally cannot. I wish I could pick him up. So if I take block off and let's say I attack him. Can I hit him? Oh, 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 okay. He got me that time. So he can't attack. Only when I attacked him, though. Hmm. All right. Other than that, he can't do anything. There really is nothing in here other than a few science books. And some empty weapon cabinets. Well, my dream of uh, baiting that guy down into town has uh, died, so. Maybe if we come back, we can grab him. Very cool though, very cool that he's still there. All right, I'm gonna quickly run out and hopefully don't get caught. Oh, simmer down, surrender yourself. Who the heck did he just knock out? Tech Hunter, Trade Ninja. Beat the heck out of that Tech Hunter who was gonna attack me. So wait, were they not gonna attack me back? Cause that'd be kind of cool. Will they let me trade at the bar or is it gonna be a big problem if I go in there? Now, they definitely won't let me trade, but nobody's giving me a hard time for being in here. Okay, so they don't like me, but they're not going to beat me up. I'm okay with this. Can we uh, loot this then? It's still early enough in the morning that if we can break in, we could probably do a little bit of thieving if we're really quick about it. But we've got to be quick. We only got about an hour. Oh, I wasn't expecting... I don't know what I was expecting, but I wasn't expecting weapons. There's a fallen sun too, and it's pretty good. What kind of place has... Weapons? Like, I'm not used to this place having weapons. Yeah, I wouldn't backpack. More backpacks. I will take the med kits, and if I can find more med kits, I'd love that. Traveler's Metacrate. Removes the stole status. Allows to stack. Oh. Okay. Ashland hat. It's kind of cool. Yeah, I like that one item. That's neat. It's different. Oh, I'll take any maps, I guess, that are of 
regions we haven't been to. We already got one Traveler's Med Crate. I don't know how this works. So all these have the stole status. So does the Med Crate go in the bell? Where does it go? I'll have to investigate this. Don't know how this works. I might be dropping that later. There we go. Ooh, a thieves backpack. A, oh, yes, perfect. We've got large backpacks too, but the thieves backpack, I'm good with that. And uh, even more good stuff. I wasn't expecting all this. Uh, I definitely want the Oh, I definitely want the armor, but we don't have the room for it. I'll get rid of this medium backpack. Um, okay, we can grab that and the dust coat. I think, though, we're going to be done for. The only thing we can maybe get, yeah, splint kits. I'd like to get some more med kits. A lot of stuff in here. Ooh, 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 wow. This place is loaded with good stuff. Yeah, I need all of this. I'll have to run out and come back. Uh, let me think for a second. Let me... Cause I'll never make it. I'll, I'll never make it back here before these people wake up. All right. If they're not attacking me, then I should be able to send Dozer in here. I've got about 30 minutes. If Dozer can make it, I want those sleeping bags, I think. And the advanced med kits. I want everything in here, but... All right, definitely take the, oh, no. Okay, definitely take the backpack. I'll keep these on me. I don't know, take that for now. I'm probably gonna drop it. I don't know how it works, technically. Take these weapons that we may or may not keep. Well, we're probably gonna keep them. But we're just, we're already getting to that point where we're gonna run out of room. Wait, why'd that stack up to 15? Is that? Because of this? I'm not used to that stacking so high. I'm going to say it has nothing to do with that, though. Okay, they're still not up. Let's get those, the advanced uh, kits there. Okay, let's be real quick about this. Make sure we definitely got everything else, especially med kits. Cause God, we cannot have enough. Ooh, okay, a weapons cabinet. Ah, uh, desert saber, some more falling suns, and reinforced saber. Not as good. These ones are pretty nice, though. Holy crap! That's a good fallen sun. <gasps> Edge type one crack saber. Ooh. I'd rather do this. Okay, none of this that great. A lot of backpacks, kits, engineers map. Tech hunters map, ancient labs. Maybe we'll find some ancient labs. Oh, location already known. All oh, same for that.
Yeah, I'm hoping we'll find some tech hunter locations that are in the new area we're in. Okay. I think that's everything that I can grab. Yeah. Um, I will take the splint kits. I wouldn't mind one large backpack. Actually, it's better than the medium backpack, isn't it? No. No, I'm reading it wrong. I'll take... I think I'd take two of them for Kugai and Tarsus because they could probably hold them and they can ho definitely hold more equipment with them. See, I knew I missed medkits. I was so focused on everything else, I kind of grazed over the medkits. I just wasn't expecting this place to have such good gear. That's crazy. I'll have to definitely go ahead and get uh, get some of these uh, fallen suns on everybody because they'll be they'll use them right up. All right, Dozo, let's get out of here. It kind of makes me want to loot other places in here if it's all going to be that good. Probably won't all be that good though. There's really no other. The only other place would be to loot. Um, the bar? I thought there was one other. This residential, but I doubt. I doubt that it has any good stuff in it. Okay. Oh, what a find. What a find. So, people who, let's see, people who have weapons that I'd like to get. So, I know somebody's using a saber. You got a hacker. Where's our saber user? So, you've... Scoops already has an edge type one saber. I know somebody else here is using one. Um, you've got a foreign saber, saber penguin, but I think I'm gonna give you this. This could be a much better saber. You'll be a lot better with it. That fallen sun I'd like to give to somebody. It's pretty good. But I guess we'll hold off. I've got another thieves backpack. Richard's got that. So Sir Camo, let's see. Penguin, we're gonna give you the thieves backpack. Um, who didn't have armor? You don't have pants, but we didn't pick pants up. We're gonna have you take the large backpack, I think. Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna have you take the large backpack. Then all this can be stored in here. I could keep the medium backpacks, but I'm kinda to the point. All right, so one large backpack, and we'll. Uh, I don't want. I don't want to keep the backpacks because I can get more of them later. And I, I just. They're, they're not. Like I can, I can get more later, and they're. I don't think I really want to load them up. Anyways, maybe. Here, keep these advanced split kits on you. Or take two of them. Now you've got three. We'll have everybody will have some splint kits on them. I need to set these guys up for splint rigging anyways. I haven't set everybody up. Only I'm set up to do it right now. So If we get everybody else set up to do it, then we'll be good. Okay. 
I don't know if this works. Do I just keep it in my inventory? I can't do anything with it. I mean, I literally don't know what it does. All right, we'll move the rest of the sleeping bags in here. Trade with uh, Tarsus, right? No, Kugai. Give him two of those. We'll trade with Penwin, who's also a medic, and give him some of these. And Penwin, go trade with Sir Camo. Give him this small little backpack. We'll have Malakath here, who I forgot to give a pole arm, I realized later on. And Bog picked the medium up. All right, so everybody's got backpacks. I don't know if this is a good or a bad idea, but they've got them. All right, we'll keep the armor here. Lots of food. Let's uh, keep rolling then. So now we know this is here. And it's a pretty good looting spot. We've got uh, Katoon here, whatever it is as well. Katon? Katoon? Um... The Royal Valley. Let's take this road down that way. The group's starting to get a lot slower. I see Commander Short Sight and Provolone here slowing down for whatever reason. Oh, he's got a bunch of uh, meat on him. I keep forgetting to trade transfer over to Dozer. A uh, whole pack of gurus. Nice. Oh, have him follow the fog heavy. That's right. He's the slowest. After all. Okay. We can, bu we can fight those beak things, but we're going to avoid them. Ooh, Shek Challenge is moving towards your outpost. Okay, how close are they? Ah, eh, we're going to fight the beat things. They're pretty close. We're going to need to go back there and deal with that. All right, let's fight these beak things, and then we'll do that. Oh, <gasps> no. God, no. Oh, I put everybody on hold and passive. And I don't really want to fight skin spiders. Can it be avoided? Bullies to uh, bog down, so we're just going to have to do it. We'll take half the group and attack all here. And these... Okay, everybody attack. All right. Yeah, we're just doing it. We're going for it. I know we're going to be able to fight it. It's just it's it's going to definitely hurt. Oh, not as bad as I thought, actually. I was expecting much worse. But just to make sure they don't get us, give us a problem. Oh, no, they don't have any food. They only drop animal claws, which we can pick up. That would make sure that they wouldn't get back up. But uh, what's the point? Then let's hurry up and get out of here. Before they uh, start getting back up. And then I got to go back and deal with home base. Because I think the Shek Challengers is a little bit more difficult. So send him over there. Head back to base. We haven't been back here in a while. How's food stores looking? That's where everybody's gathered anyways. They're alright. We're good. I'm um, getting a little low. I believe we could have Lipsky run over. I think he can pull some more water out of here. And some of these guys are gathering around the the bread bin here so I think they've been uh, eating bread as well I actually should do this with somebody who's got a backpack if I remember 
If I remember who has a backpack. Uh, okay, Big Daddy does. And he can grab the bread too, if there's any. Yeah, decent amount. So we're surviving off of bread, and, literally bread and water. Uh, okay, I'll check on that in a second. How's everything else looking? I needed to get the copper ingots up and I didn't. And there's no fogman out here because we haven't put any bodies. Let me, Stuart, come out here and I see we've got a chance. So if we could do it quick. Before the Shek get here, we're going to need every single Fogman we can muster. And if I could pick these guys up, I'll do it with them too. Okay. And this will keep them here for a while too. I'm thinking about moving these ones over here, all up here. Can that Fog Praetorian be recruited? No. But one of the princes can. No, it's the person in the cage. How close are the shack? Oh, they're still a real long way away. We've got some time. All right, let's let those guys handle that and head back to this group. Hmm. We were fighting big things, huh? Oh, we seem to have handled it well. I need to keep grabbing these. I keep kind of passing over them. Oh, skim spiders too? Jesus. Whole area is kind of dangerous. Good thing we came down here equipped. And we're getting food out of it. Alright, well before we keep getting hit, we need to keep moving. I'll just keep an eye on the uh, Shek and then I'll head up there once they get closer. I wonder how many we have to worry about. Uh, Drexel, could you go grab this fog heavy? Because I definitely am not going to play this game. All right, Red heading down into the Royal Valley. Sounds like a place that a hive queen would be. Oh, what did he say? Okay, what about gre Grieve Wraiths? They're definitely real. Are you serious? The old conversation came back up. What are the chances? Uh, my game keeps acting weird, so I'm going to go ahead and save it. I just don't want to lose any progress I've made. Um, actually, not that it matters anyways, because we're out of time. And it's a good place to leave it at. So heading into the Royal Valley, what do we got here? Looks like we've got herself a squad of drone guard from the Southern Hive. I think we've come to the right place. But man, are these guys geared and uh, outfitted and deadly looking. Drone gunners. Wow. Ooh, we made drone guard heavy. 60s, 50s. Ooh, we may be in over our head. Southern Hive Prince. Yikes. All right. Well, we'll have to keep exploring in the next episode. Thank you all for joining me. Hope that you've enjoyed it. Look forward to seeing you next time.